Hey everybody, welcome back to our channel. If this is your first time watching, I am Amaka and this is my sister, Adia. And we're gonna try something different. We thought it'd be a fun series to start something new. What normally happens is, obviously we're both moms. My sister was a mom before I was and now I have younger kids and her kids are older. But what we've been finding, or what I've been finding, is like a lot of things that I experienced with her being a first time mom, I didn't have my kids yet, a lot of things are happening to her. And I, some things I understood, some things I didn't get, some things I just chalked it up to, you'll get it when you're a mom, or that happens to all moms. But now that I'm a mom, and my kids are younger, and she's surpassed that stage, I find myself talking to her a lot, but like, do you remember when that happened to you? Or remember when I said I didn't get that? Now I get it. So we thought it'd be a fun little series to start um, just talking about these experiences. You know, it, it will happen to you. Because I remember her telling me several stories uh, over the co course of her being a mom. And I didn't get it. It didn't register. It didn't hit. And now I'm like, it's hidden. It's hidden and I'm getting it. So we thought it'd be a fun little series because we're talking about this daily with each other all the time. So let's just share it with you guys. So do you remember what I'm talking about, <laughs> I remember exactly what you're talking about because, okay, so what do they call this? Baby brain, mommy brain, or whatever it's called. But I know I would have like a fog that hit me from, you know, soon as that baby pretty much started baking in the oven and it did not go away for a long time. And I was like, I'm not, I know I'm not this dumb, <laughs> but what is happening to my brain cells? <laughs> I know and I remember frequently like things would happen like made a conversation and I could just tell there was a lag and it wasn't anything judgmental but you'd be saying like mom brain and I'm like is it though is it mom brain <laughs> you don't get it until you're a mom there but I always just assume like yeah I guess and I don't know because now mom brains hit me I don't remember if in that time period if I thought like ah, it's her or that happens to people it's not going to happen to me Knowing my personality when I was younger, it probably was that, but boy, did it hit me. <laughs> and so it's just, I remember my sister, okay, we're five years apart and her oldest is 12. So I think I was 20 years old. Yeah, I was a fresh 20 year old when she had her first baby. She was 25, right? That's the math? Yeah. I think that's the math, mom brain. <laughs> So yeah, so she was 25, had her first kid and I was 20 and I was, you know, in my young adult life, I was working. Um, and so I remember I would be talking to her all the time and just, so I was 20 and I was 22 when she had the next one and 24. And so I was young. I was getting my fresh full eight to 10 hours of sleep every night. I was yep. doing whatever I wanted, when I wanted, doing like just running here, running there, running here, not even knowing that that was a luxury. <laughs> but I remember we frequently talked when she had her first, she, we were in the same state, then she moved, but we would FaceTime all the time, just like we do now. Um, of course, it was around my work schedule. So I remember it was several conversations that several times she'd be telling me stories and I'm like, I don't get it. I don't get it. And look, you can see my little ones, what I'm dealing with now. This is what would happen. How ironic. This is what would happen. We'd be FaceTiming and the kids would be distracted and like, get to the point of your story. What are you trying to tell me? So here we are. I'm living proof that this is what's happening. But, um... <laughs> I remember several times, like just mom brain in general. And so look at that, look at that. Look at my kids <laughs> leaving on their own. <laughs> anyway, so I just remember I'd be at work and calling. Like I remember one time, like I had got a phone calls, like 10 in a row. And I'm like, girl, you know I'm working. Why are you calling me? I, and it was like, I think employers now are a little more relaxed, but it was back then like, you weren't even supposed to be bringing your phone to work. But I remember, I was like, why are you calling me so much? Why are you calling me? It's like, is it me calling? Or is it your godson calling? <laughs> you know? Just little things like that. Like there was just, just so much chaos going on all the time. And like little things like, um, I remember I'd go to free, visit her frequently and it'd be like, oh, I need this for the baking. Do you have happen to have some milk? It's like, I do, but it's the fat free. I'm like, why yeah. are you getting fat free yeah. milk? And she was like, yeah. I, I just, I didn't know what I was getting. I knew I needed milk. I just grabbed it. I thought I didn't know what I grabbed. And it turns out it was the wrong one. And I remember I'd always think like, just look at what you're grabbing. Like, <laughs> why can't you just look at what you're grabbing or just go back and look at your list? I'm like, I left the list at home on the counter. 
okay? Uh, look at what I'm grabbing. Well, the kid's trying to jump out of the cart, and so I'm right by the milk, so I'm just reaching, and I'm just going. I'm just trying to get out of there. I got into the store, and five minutes later, I'm just trying to get out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's just so many stories of things like that, and I was, I chalked it up to mom brain, but it's like I don't know, I don't get it yet. Yeah. Flash forward, I am now been a mom for four and a half years. My oldest is four and a half, and I don't know when the mom brain started. I just know it hasn't left. <laughs> is, I never thought it would happen to you. My sister has always been just quick wit, just quick, like sharp. And I was like, dang, she might not get it. Like she, I don't see this ever happening to you. It happened. And it happened over time, I'm pretty sure. I don't know, but yesterday, what I, the topic of today being mom brain, I think yesterday was an all time wow. And I, I had an experience and I just left thinking like, I hope that person doesn't think I'm really this stupid. <laughs> Because I swear, I'm educated, I'm smart, I know stuff. But what happened yesterday? Uh -oh. The story is, I have had, I bought an ebook online months and months ago. And it was, it's a, a workout guide. And so I okay. thought I was being cheap and I bought the ebook. Like, oh yeah, sure, I'll just look at it on my computer. And then when I try to do it, I'm like, this ain't gonna work. I need the I need the book. So I've been holding off mom life. So I finally was like, you know what? I'm gonna go get that book printed. I'm gonna get it printed. I have a printer. So I try to do that first. And then it's like 200 something pages. Like, never mind. Let me go get it printed. So I went to go email myself a copy so that when I got to the print shop, I could just be like, oh, here, what's your email? Let me email it to you. Okay. It's an ebook though, so obviously they're making money. They made it so it's like you can't share this file. You can't like email the file, because I think I tried to have email to Chris, and I could. I was having trouble with emailing it, so I was like You're having trouble emailing. That's okay. The, the, the thing is, <laughs> the thing is, at this point, we don't even know if that was the problem. All I know is in my head, I was like, I can't get this document off of my computer. How am I going to print it if my printer can't print it? So I took my whole computer, my whole laptop to the print shop. And okay, I was there like, we go. <laughs> I'm talking to the guy, he's like, how can I help you? I'm like, I have something on my computer <laughs> that I need you guys to print, but I can't get it off my computer. How, do you, how, how, how can I get my computer to talk to your printer so that I could print this? And the guy is looking like, so it's just like, what kind of document? I'm like, it's just right here. It's an Adobe Acrobat reader, but, I can't share it, so I don't know how, how you guys could print it for me. And so he's like, we can just put our thumb drive right here. And when he did that, I was like, I know I didn't work 10 plus years in the corporate world to have completely forgotten what a thumb drive is and how I could have had this for months if I would have just <laughs> downloaded, oh just plug God. it in and then slice, you know, you just plug it in and swipe it over. Yes. Yeah, you just, just transfer the just, file. Just do that. Over. That's all I had to do. But I really had brought my whole laptop. And my whole, the whole time is because I was running errands that day. So that laptop was in the car. And I kept in like, oh, I got to hide my laptop because my laptop's in here. <laughs> like, it was such an ordeal. Like, oh, my gosh, I, I hope we don't take too long because my laptop's in the car. <laughs> I didn't even need my laptop. Oh, gosh, just like an old person. What if it was a desktop? You would have unplugged it and brought the whole desktop? No. But in that moment, I just felt like, wow, Mac, like, dang dog, it's getting bad. Like, you, do you need a break? Or, because I was really like, I can't believe I really was that, I can't, I can't believe I thought that. And that was, that was my mom brain moment of the year. Brought my whole computer. Wow. He's like, here we go, man, we can just, and then I tried to play it off like, oh yeah, I didn't have one of those. Ooh, ooh, I didn't have, oh, thank you. <laughs> I didn't have one of those. There we go. Perfect. You have one. Great. I have like 18 in the desk right now. Oh, my goodness. oh man, that mom brain be hitting hard. Oh, no. hitting hard. It is. Oh. I'm just, I'm hopeful that it's not forever because I've seen the fog has lifted for you. Not completely. Not completely. There's still a little bit of, of, of um, you know, cloud coverage, but. The, the sun peeks through every once in a while. Yeah, you lose your words, you lose sentences, you will lose all of it. It all just veil over the top. 
But oh little by God. little, it starts to come back up and you won't bring your whole entire computer to get a document printed. That is hilarious. In 2021, the year of endless information, technology and everything brought my whole computer to the print shop. The oh. only, the only like saving grace was that I had all three kids with me. Okay. But the thing was like, I don't even know if it mattered because he seemed like he probably didn't have kids because he did one of those like, Ooh, we can print it definitely, but it's probably going to be ready in about 45 minutes. Could you come right, come right back? We'll be done. It's like, you, I didn't have, it's going to take 45 minutes for me to get these kids back, unload them, then load, load them back up, in. Load them up, Yeah. This, that's not going to work. <laughs> I'll see you guys in about four or five hours when I can get back here, okay? So. Oh my God. Well, the story is, if anyone's watching this that's not a mom, when you see somebody walk in with all these kids, especially someone this little, and her kids are just running all over the place into a small area, just have show some grace, okay? They probably got some mom brain to work with. <laughs> yeah, the mom brain is a real thing. Like, it is completely real. You cannot, you can't really play it off until it's completely revealed to you how dumb the thing was that you either said or did and then you're like oh my gosh how did i get here um please share your mom brain moments in the comments below so that my <laughs> sister doesn't feel... I don't feel so alone because i promise i'm smart i swear I am. i'm a smart girl i have done so many mom brain things so i know that you know that it happens but I think it'll help if like people actually share their their mom brain moments with us. Oh yes, my please God. do. So I know I'm not alone. And we'll get through it together. Yes. Yes. Um all right, well is there anything else that we wanted to share? I think that'll I think that's enough of my, me revealing myself, my wit. God. Yeah, but there's definitely oh, tons of these moments. There's oh, been yeah. so many conversations that have you started this way. So we'll be getting back with another video. I'm sure in no time. Like, yeah. That happened to you is happening now. How did you get through it again? Yeah. So, yeah. So stay tuned. Stay tuned. I'll be sharing more of my mom brain moments and definitely um give you that light at the end of the tunnel feeling because you know it's getting better it gets better it gets easier so hopeful all right guys don't forget to subscribe share this video and leave us a comment and we so appreciate all the love and support thanks for Thank watching you so much guys